Okay, Algebra 1, Chapter 7, Section 8, Special Products. If you read through the book, there's a couple of uh, a couple of little formulas for these. I don't teach them that way. I'm not saying that it's wrong. Uh, I just go a different direction. I like to hammer home the information that we've already worked. And so that's what we're going to do. Uh, I will show you some, some little tricks along the way that might help out. But uh, for right now, we're basically just doing what we've done before, and it's mostly um, FOIL method. For example, you're going to get something that looks like that. x plus 4 to the second power. What you have to recognize right away is I want to take x plus 4 times itself. That's what x4 x plus 4 to the second power means. One of the most common mistakes is a kid right here would take x squared and then they take 4 squared and give me an answer of x squared plus 16, which in this is in this example is not the case. So this is just FOIL method. We're going to do first outside inside and last. <coughs> Noticing that those two common terms in the middle, that's going to give me x squared plus 8x plus 16. <coughs> Sorry about that. All right. Let's do another example. Okay, go ahead and hit pause and work that one on your own. And we're back. That's going to be x minus 12 times x minus 12. First terms. Outside terms. Inside terms. And last terms. That's going to leave me with x squared minus 24x plus 144. Again, not new information, just looks a little different. Now, what if we get we get the exact same thing except in the middle one's a minus and one's a plus. Watch what happens here. So we're going to do first outside inside and last. If I have the exact same thing one with a minus one with a plus what's going to happen every time is the middles are going to cancel out. So that's just 4x squared minus 16. Okay, so go ahead and hit pause on this one and see what you come up with. Okay, that's going to give me 9x squared plus 27x. Most of you see what's coming here in the middle. That's going to be minus 27x and then minus 81. Those are going to cancel, leaving me with 9x squared minus 81. Again, if they are the exact same terms, one's a plus, one's a minus, then you're going to end up with the two middle sections or the two middle values here canceling out completely, leaving you just with your first and last terms. Okay, let's try one more. Um, let's go one more of each.
Okay, go ahead and hit pause on this one and work both of those and come back. Let's see how we do. Okay, here I'm going to rewrite. That's going to give me 4x squared plus 14x plus 14x plus 49, giving me a grand total of 4x squared plus 28x plus 49. And then over here, I'm going to get 9x squared plus 6x minus 6x minus 4. Two terms in the middle cancel. And I come up with 9x squared minus 4. Okay, so a little over six minutes for Chapter 7, Section 8, Special Products.